Hi! So it's Thursday and we're gonna be doing another Town Spiral Remastered unboxing. I've stopped counting how many boxes I'm opening and have been opening. But for this channel, this would be the third, second technically, third. But we'll see if I still manage to get that first video back. Anyway, I got this package from our local game store and distributor, Neutral Grounds. Time Spiral Remastered with a Zendikar Rising Set Booster Box in English. And there's a Japanese one too, but I'm not gonna open that. Um, thinking of opening the Zendikar Set Booster Box as well, but uh, let's just start with this. Hope we get something good. And let's play some music. Hmm. I'll have to do. All right. Let's take this, these packs out of the box, and let's see how fast. It'll take for me to open all 36 boosters. And let's hope we get something good. Um, Andrew, uh, my co host in this channel, and the original only host in this channel, opened a box earlier too and didn't get such a um, good result out of the box that he opened. So, I'm hoping that we're gonna fare better. So first mythic and my dog is barking in the background. Sorry about that. Let's put the mythics here. Dried Arbor, leveler. Nothing good yet. Try it over, it's not bad. It's about five dollars. US dollars. I see drown, molten rain, and a foil joyous time bug. I think my dog wants to join in the opening. Boom and Bust and Paradoxical Outcome. Summoner's Pack and Primeval Titan. Got one already. Yeah, we did. Knight of the Relic Quarry and Foil Rebuff the Wicked. <laughs> Double rare, but not the good one. But hey, here's a good one. Pact of Negation, Panharmonicon. So let's put some of the, the better rares here. Greater Gargadon and Young Pyromancer. That's not bad. Flagstones of Trocare and SRAM. Or SRAM as I call it. Mangara. I think we have a foil. Talrin. And oh, it's a foil time shifted card. Wastes, that's not bad at all. It's actually pretty good. Surprisingly. So, again, we got the foil on the first 
column, which means that we have a good chance of getting another foil later in the back. In the not in the back, but maybe in the third column somewhere here. I hope. But so far, we got a good time shifted foil, so I'm happy about that. Draining Welk and Banishing Light. Not a lot of um, explosive cards yet, though. And only one mythic so far. Well, two mythics now. We got an Acromas Memorial. Okay. Lotus Bloom and Reclamation Sage. Life and Limb and uh, Lingering Souls. That should go here. Pomonic Sliver and Anger of the Gods. And we're almost halfway through the box. So, so far we got a good time shifted foil but not much else aside from that and again the comments and uncomments are starting to crowd up the box so let me just fix it a bit <laughs> see what i do it'll do for now Avenger and Exquisite Firecraft. So still, still only two mythic and um, one foil. One foil time shifted and no foil rares yet. Living in third mythic, yikes. A and Ancient Den. That's not the mythic that you want to see. There's not a lot of mythics in this. Oh, I saw a mythic and um, Seems like a good one. Joyra, Sumer Ascendancy, and Sliver Legion Foil Mythic. That's great. I don't know how much it's worth, but I know the normal one is around $50. So the foil has to be a little bit higher for sure. I know there were some sets, there are some sets now where the um, where the foil versions are actually cheaper than the non-foil versions because of the collector booster boxes and the not so good printing of, of some of the foils in some sets like Kaldheim had some pretty bad foil really dark I don't know if it's the same for all the countries maybe that's just the cards that are printed in the US or in Japan. It's one or the other, right? For English language at least. Rada and Solem Simulacrum. Also not you know what? We don't have anything too good in terms of the non-foil cards yet, aside from these two. The foils the foils are the ones that are carrying the box's weight so far. But we're almost done with the box. Let's see some good mythics and good time shifted cards. Fungus liver and Dove and Savito. Well, that's not it. But, like, we don't have any Thoughtseize yet. Or Chalice or Ponder. Eon Chronicler. Triumph. Not even a Karmagoyf. Damnation. Gemstone Cap. Chalice, I need a chalice, I remember. I opened a box because I am searching for a chalice of the void because um, I'm short. <laughs> okay, I'm short one copy. And a true name nemesis, that's pretty good. Hey, foil Lari OS, that's not bad. 
But yeah, I hope we get one. Send your Yogmoth. Okay, that's also not bad. Let's hope we get more. <laughs> right? Because why not? Caravac and Itali. And one, two, three, four, five packs left over there. One pack of me. Okay. Hive stone and feather. Alright, let's fix you up. So we got a couple of good foil rares. Uh, well, one foil rare and one foil mythic. Thelon, Mystic Sanctuary. Only three mythics so far. I, ha I hope you get more. I hope we get two more. The last box I opened had six, and they were all great mythics. Jaya and Green Merchant could have been Thoughtseize. Three packs left. Come on, box. Glitter English, Kasali Pride Mage. There's a foil. No foil in this pack. Wheel of Fate. <laughs> it's a mythic, not a good one. I mean, not so good. Last pack. Alright. This can't be another mythic, so I guess the mythics are bust. Coalition Relic and Mull Drifter. Yikes. Okay, so if not for the foils, the box would have been a pretty bad one, I think. But the foils more than made up for it. In fact, let me check the prices real quick. Sliver Legion is $94 and the foil waste on the other hand is hard to find. <laughs> ah, foil waste is $91. I'm not gonna check the Lorian Academy anymore, but yeah, so ninety-seven, ninety-four. It's almost $200 in value in just the foil, so even though the non-foil cards are not so great, these more than made up for it. Almost paid for the box. Well, not quite, but almost, because I got the box for maybe around $250? $300? Yeah, $250 is closer. Well, yeah, so these are the good ones. Um, not really that good, but so these three are the good ones. Once above ten dollars i guess it's also about ten dollars um this one is not so bad i think it's around seventeen uh, dollars maybe eighteen um then mystic sanctuary it's not so bad so then i guess it's not so bad mystic confluence um i think tolerant is not so bad price wise young pyromancer Primeval Titan, uh, Beast Whisper here, and uh, for the rest, for the normal rares, nothing that stands out. Lario West, I guess, is good. Sarah Avenger will go to my deck. Flagstones of True Care is good. And Double Draw Move, Dryad Arbor. That's it. Thanks for watching.